Goodbye. Hello, everybody. It is Zero Visibility here. Uh, kind of a weird scenario. I don't know if you're going to be seeing this video or not, but uh, I am working on soloing A1 in GTFO. I've tried this many times and failed, gotten very far in many occasions. But right now, I have a setup that is undeniably very lucky. So, I made it through the first areas with uh, relative ease. I think I ran, I think I woke up one room on my way here, but I didn't take a lot of damage from it, so it was fine. Um, I'm about to do the first alarm door in A1, and I have three seafoam grenades in this level. And as some of you may remember about A1, the second alarm door on this rundown has three doors, is a cluster alarm, class three, and is very tough to get through solo. But with three seafoam grenades, I have a feeling I could pull it off. Maybe. Right now, what I'm trying to make a final decision on that's killing me is whether or not I spend a seafoam grenade on this first alarm. Because this first alarm is a normal alarm and it's only class two, which means only one set of four circles after the big one. I have mines, so I can easily blow up a wave. The thing that I'm worried about is if I blow up the first wave before I finish charging the circles, which inevitably will happen because I don't think I'll be able to charge all the circles fast enough um, depending on where they go. They, the circles could fuck me too. I'm not factoring that into this equation. Um, I might end up summoning a second wave if I kill enough of them with the first mine. And I'm almost certain I'm going to not get another seafoam. I've only ever seen two seafoam grenades spawn in this level, at least in the high objective, let alone three. I've never seen that before. So the chances that four spawn are extremely slim. But this is only one set of circles. Like, I feel like I could handle this alarm. It's just if that second wave gets spawned, I could be in deep trouble. I, I, I want to save the seafoam. I really do. I feel like I can handle this. So, we're going to prepare for large guys in case they come in. Because I don't want to be caught with my pants down from them. I've done this plenty of times without seafoam. Here we go. Okay, they're not coming from the doors on the sides, which is kind of what I expected. That one's going down, fuck it. Let's go get that one next. There was a big guy. Here they come. Second wave incoming. I knew it. I knew I would have to deal with one. It's alright, I still got the bridge mines. We're fine. I've got this. I've got this. I've got this. Killed a couple. Accidentally shot my gun there. Ooh, there's a big guy. Oh, that big guy's gonna fuck me up. Fuck. Fuck. Focus. 
Oh, the big guy. Oh, my God. I got to get a little more distance. You know what I'm going to do? gonna say why did the music stop okay I did it that was good that was good shit okay we made it past the first hurdle that was really good I think I spent every single mine that I placed Oh, no, 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 no. There's one left. There's this one right over here. This one did not blow. So I have one mine. <laughs> but that's okay. I got a tool refill nearby. I have more. Okay. Okay. God, man. I get so tense doing shit like this. But that that is going to be worth it. That is absolutely going to be worth it. Having the sea foam left over. This is a one use? Oh. Oops. I thought it was a two use. That's okay. I got three mines. That's really all I need, to be honest. If I get more, that'll be great. Okay. Oh, man. I get so tense playing this solo. I make so many mistakes. I probably took far more hits than I needed to there. But the important thing is that I survived. Hurdle number two. Not alerting a scout. I do not have a weapon that can instant kill a scout. I don't even think the combat shotgun can do it from the back of the head unless you get all of the shells into the scout. So, not even worth trying to be honest. Better to go for the melee kill. This is relatively quiet. No scout in here. Thankfully. Oh, this room's clear. Okay, cool. Got the music. Got the music cue. Alright. <sighs> Man. I'm, my heart is still pounding. I thought I was going to fuck that up. I got close to fucking it up. My health got pretty low. Alright, there's one of the med packs. Two use. Carry that for now. Artifact. Honestly... I mostly just practice on A1 and A2. A2 more for the alarms because it's harder for me to do the first alarm alone. Um, because I just want to get better at the game. And I can also farm boosters so that I have better boosters when I play with the guys. But uh, I've been wanting to beat this level solo for some time. And there was one particular time where I got so goddamn close. Ooh, a free mine. Awesome. Okay, uh, where am I at? This is 63A. Uh, 63A mine. Okay. I'm gonna go in this door first. Much less chance of this gap being in here. Okay. No scout. If a scout was back here, in this right door, I would be the happiest I could ever be. Sleepers. Don't wake them. There's only one more around the corner here. There he is. Nope. I knew he was going to be in that room. That's where he pretty much always spawns. He can spawn in any of the Zone 63 rooms, but that is his most common one. So, 
let's just hope that the enemies are not too dense in there. Which they usually are, so I'm not counting on anything. I don't count on anything in this game because I don't want to be disappointed. Oh my god! Are you fucking serious? Holy shit! This is the one. If I if I cannot beat this solo on this run, then I'll never beat a level solo. Like this is this is the one. Force. I've only ever gotten two on this fucking level. Are you serious? Oh my god. I can't fuck this up now. If I fuck this up, I will be so mad at myself. Oh my god. Okay. Oh. Lots of enemies in lots of enemies in here. So many enemies in here. That's actually a really good sign. They might have dropped their enemy load on this room. So I need to get to the terminal and ping resources and see if there's anything in there that's worth getting. If the tool refill is in there, I'll probably go for it. But other than that, I don't think I'd even waste my time. <gasps> wow, did not know he was that close. take out that one on the right, I'll be in a much better position for... Oh my god, is he actually going down there? What? I've never seen that. I've never seen him go down there. I'm not taking any chances, dude. Not a single goddamn one. stairs. Damn. I was gonna say, if he came back up here, that's an easy kill. Easy fucking kill. But, it's alright. It's alright. I can do this. So, the enemy thickness is not bad in here. I'm not gonna take on that group till I kill this scout, though. I might get the one on the far side if I'm feeling saucy, but not gonna even touch that group. Easiest scout kill of my life. The luck with this run is unbelievable. Unfucking believable. I have never in my life had this kind of luck playing this. Ever. I'm stunned. This is fucking fantastic! I feel fantastic! Hey, hey, hey! Alright, we got a double kill there. That guy is awfully close. Mm, actually, he might be far away enough. I just gotta be ready to kill whoever gets up if one of them does. Enemies in here aren't too thick. Ah, no, 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 no. You guys are going to be together. Oh, that one decided to stretch too. Perfect. Just in case. 
And this is why you have the long range flashlight when you play solo. That was so easy. I've never even seen the scout go down there when he spawns in that room. Not even once. I've also had, like, besides that room off to the side, I've had extremely light rooms with enemies. Even the room that I triggered uh, wasn't that full. Which is probably why I was able to handle it only taking, like, 30 damage. I, I cannot... I cannot believe the RNG that I'm getting right now. This is literally the best I've ever had it in this game. And I am not, I will never in my life become a solo player for this game. I'm sorry, I am just not good enough at video games in general. Uh, if I put insurmountable amounts of hours into this game, maybe. Maybe. But this game is, one, designed for four people. Two, even with four people, is insanely hard. We got sleepers. Don't wake them. Like, no I can barely get to a point where I can solo A1 without at least, like, two seafoam grenades. Three is honestly the sweet spot, but without at least two, I can't even do it. And I can't bring the Seafoam Launcher because I need either a turret or a Mind Deployer to handle the enemies. I don't even know how people solo the later levels. Like, I watch the videos and it's just baffling to me. The way that they abuse the movement of the game to get away from enemies and kite and stuff. Like, how would you even do C1 solo on this? You have to charge that huge-ass Apex door at the beginning. Like... I don't even know how you'd pull it off. Because it charges so slow. I've gotten it up to like 50% before I died. And that's the furthest I've gotten playing that level solo. It's not like I went in trying to solo it. I was just fucking around. I kind of do want to... This is a dumb idea. This is a really stupid idea. What if I just blow this door with a mine? I feel like I have enough mines. Let me get a look at it again. Ooh, don't everybody get up at once. Jesus Christ. Alright, so there's one, two, three, four. Potentially a fifth back there. Five. He's alone. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There's definitely a 12th on the catwalk. I could clear this. I've cleared harder rooms. Let's be perfectly honest. I have cleared much harder rooms than this. As long as I don't touch anything, I'll be fine. Fuck it. I like the street cred. It's fine. Plus, it's more practice. Oh, he didn't get the scream out. Ah, ha, ha, yeah, baby. Did it. Street cred for me. Yeah, I bet you there's jack shit in here. Bet you it was completely pointless to clear this room. Yep, it sure was. There's literally nothing in here. Ha! Well, whatever. I cleared it. I'm the best. It's fine. Double kill right there. Pretty easy one. Take out this guy up top first. Oh. Quiet. Sleepers. Don't make a sound. (laughs) 
I do enjoy the body physics in this game, especially when they bug out. Oh, I just thought of something bad. I may have to clear this room, these rooms, multiple times. Because I'm going to have to keep going back for seafoam. Mm. That's a shame, but I mean, what are you going to do? Like, I don't really have a choice. I guess I could have brought... You know what? Before I get too deep here, let me go grab the first sea foam. See, so look, nothing. None of them respawned yet, but I think it's because I didn't clear the room. Alright, there's that room. Alright, let me go grab the sea foam from 62. One room respawned is better than multiple. So, the quicker I can switch them up closer to me, the better. Oh, yeah. Look at how many fewer enemies there are in here. On the blank. It's, it's fine. Fuck you. Yeah, shut your mouth. Okay. I got it that time. I got it that time. Because he turned on me. Okay. All right, all right, all right. I didn't have anything else in here to switch this last seafoam grenade into, did I? I don't think so. So, we'll have to move on ahead. I'm sure one of these rooms will be clear, and it might be this next one, but we'll have to see. I think this one might be clear. I'm pretty sure that's the clear music. Yep. Box here. Ammo. Two uses. I don't fucking need it. Nothing on the right. A double kill there. Yoink! Say goodbye to your ass, sir. I forgot, since I already opened this room, they had already spawned in. Yeah, there's definitely a few in here. More than a few. I didn't even need to, but I did it anyway. Okay! Let's get this fucking party started. Oh, you know what? I could see from this door, too. Because that's where they're going to spawn, is out here. And they never come through that top door, so there's really no point in sea foaming it. Okay, okay, okay. I like this. Okay. I, I'm pretty sure big guys don't spawn with these waves, but they might. I could be completely wrong with that assumption. So one wave is going to almost completely die at that door. I am going to mine up places near the two other doors that I see foam because I don't want the enemies that might be left over from the first wave to break down either door. I want them to be completely dead. I don't know if I'm ready for this, man. I'm fucking scared.
Oh my god. I gotta get that one now. I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. No! I open my eyes. I try to see, but I'm blinded by the white light. Goodbye. I can't remember Fuck! how, I can't remember why I'm lying here tonight I And I can't I stand I the pain And I can't make it go away No, I can't stand the pain How could this happen? Fucking charge it! I'm sick of this life. Fuck I you! Fuck you! I'm done with this bullshit! No, I'm fucking dead, bro. I'm fucking dead. Everybody's screaming. I try to make a sound, but no one hears me. no goddamn way. I'm slipping off the edge. I'm hanging by a thread I want to start this over again So I try to hold on to a time when Nothing mattered and I can't Okay, the gods have given me another chance I'm fucked, there's no way dude there's no way. How the fuck? Why? Why the circle RNG is bullshit? How could this happen to me? I've made my mistakes. Got nowhere to run. The night goes on as I'm fading away. Are you I'm sick of fucking kidding me. I just want to scream. What is this? Everybody, cool. This is gonna suck. I am not looking forward to it. I've only got two sea foam grenades. I've only got two sea foam grenades. It's gonna suck. I'm not gonna win, but fuck it, you know. Couldn't be any worse circle RNG than last time, could it? Probably will be, but let's go. Hate this game. Love this game, hate this game.
like really stop the first wave for good. No. You're kidding me. You're, you're kidding me, right? Come and get me, bitches. I ain't fucking scared of you. Come on, motherfuckers! That broke the lock off the door. <laughs> oh, watch behind you, Hayden. Apparently there's... Dude, am I just like the worst shot on the planet? Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Actually right now. Oh my god. Are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me right now? I don't know whether to be happy or pissed off! What the fuck was that? I can't believe I actually just soloed A1 with two Seafoam Grade. I was, this was a throwaway run, legitimately. I thought, I got nothing, okay? I got all the way to the override. I got jack shit, not a single Seafoam Grenade. I got shit enemy placement. The first fucking room in the game was like so goddamn saturated with enemies that I almost triggered a room of like 30 enemies. The scout was in a horrible place. And then lo and behold, I went into the extreme zone to do that first area, and I found a box with two seafoam grenades in it. One box with two. And I was like, this isn't gonna fucking happen, but you know what? It gave me two grenades. Let's give it a fucking shot. And I fucking beat it. I honestly thought you would need the third seafoam grenade to re-seafoam the middle door. But no, it's just the circle RNG. As long as the circle RNG doesn't fuck you in the ass, then you're golden. I don't know if I'm even going to try to solo anything else, because soloing just this level, which is the easiest goddamn level in this game, or in this rundown, was a fucking nightmare. So, I beat it. I'm the best. And I'm done. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the cavalcade of bullshit and mistakes that uh, you just bore witness to. Um, and uh, I will see you in the next video. Why am I talking about like the fire? I don't know. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Have a good night. See you later.